you that did mention storyboard. So in that context, if you explain uh, how important these concept arts are, the drawing, the sketching, I believe uh, these type of things help a lot. Like, like, let's say if I want to create my own concept art or, or my uh, own project, uh, it will help me better if I know how to draw something. It doesn't have to be awesome drawing. I mean, you don't, you don't have to be a fine artist. You just have to be an artist, you know? Like you, you can be of any type of artist. So you can draw, scribble something, and it may still look good. But anyway, the point here is uh, if we can simply try to just hold on, I'm having some issue here. Okay, so if we just try to uh, make people understand why it is important, the basics of drawing and the sketching and uh, having the knowledge of colors and understanding how the lights work, how the shadows work, shading, you know, I believe these things help a lot in creating any type of art, it doesn't matter the medium, okay? Mm -hmm. You should know these fundamentals, you should have a clear foundation. Yeah. Okay, uh, so if you can talk about these things, and I'm sure in studio, you have these people, these uh, artists who, who give you these ideas, like this is what they want. And many times even the client wants something particular, you mm -hmm. know? So mm -hmm. we, let's say, uh, I wouldn't say we in general, but I would say we in case where, let's say you are an artist, even if you are a 3D generalist, uh, sometimes you require someone who can visualize it for you and tell you, okay, this is what it should be looking like in the frame when you create it. Hmm. So like how you talked about the uh, Avengers or uh, Spider-Man. So uh, recently when I had attended Tasi, there they had shown the particulars of how they did it. So they paid a lot of attention to creating artworks first, how the, the, the that particular city will look, how the landscape will look, how the Spider-Man may look, hmm. you know, and they had different uh, Spider-Man characters. You know, from coming from different universes. Hmm. So, uh, I believe uh, creating something from scratch for your own story, you need to have this type of knowledge. So, if you can just in brief uh, explain how it helps to have the knowledge of foundation, fundamentals of art. Okay. Okay. To you, Sunny. Yeah. So, as Amber sir said, like yeah, storyboard it defines a lot. Like it's the backbone of your storyboard it's like definitely storyboard so it's the backbone of your story so like there are things like uh, like as you said fundamental things are there like lighting shading and the mood of the like whole story like if it's gonna be dark or like it's gonna be like really happy kind of thing if you'll watch a disney movie all the vibes you are getting is like really happy if you're going to watch like Harry Potter, you'll have some dark kind of shading, then there are like things. So these are like fundamental things which are like applied. But from the basic, I'll say like storyboard is the backbone. If you'll start anything, start with the storyboard and you start sketching. Yeah, definitely it doesn't matter like how it is. It's the rough thing. It matters. Like it just needs to have if, if just I can show the storyboard here. Yeah, that'll be great. Like, yeah, I think this is not my storyboard, but yeah, definitely. Yeah. No, that's fine. Yeah, we can get an example. Yeah, here. I think oh. if you share screen, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, is it's it, visible, visible. Is it on? Yeah, yeah, it's on. So, yeah, you can see like in the uh, right hand uh, side, you can see uh, like really sketchy and really kiddish kind of artwork it's there this just for the rough idea like how the shot is gonna be like how the flow is gonna be like it's written frame one action a voiceover so that gives you a basic idea like how the film is gonna be and how how the look matters is in the next part actually that's the concept art or the uh, style frame of it storyboard is just the way you know but is it compulsory yeah, I think this is compulsory because yeah, definitely if, if you are going for like 15, we, we try to see like there was a shot uh, for 15 seconds. So okay. you have to actually the storyboard, you have to assign like if the VFX work is there. So we were, we were working in film fair and uh, film fair uh, shot. So there was a shot for Varun Dhawan. 
so there was a vfx shot we had like 30 pages of vfx shot that was a like 15 second shots but we had like 15 hmm. pages of like scripts like how you had some shot with sharuk khan as well right yeah Mission. sharuk khan like there were some mixed mixed shots like sharuk khan okay. varun alia bhat so okay. there were okay. many artists there so un log ke sath mein we have to see ki wo process acha sa hona chahiye properly hona chahiye so that's why we need a story board ki right direction mein jaye even if the director will say ki give me the story board i want to see the frame how it is looking so according to that we have to adjust all the green screen all the clean plates and everything we have to decide accordingly so i think story board is a must thing for like so ye planning mein aap log ke liye bahut important yeah. role play karta hai definitely that, yeah right 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 Amber, sir, any other question? Uh, yeah, 